Hey guys, so I got this uh, Yangnu YN622N-TX um, controller here and the firmware is out of date so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to update it and then uh, we'll do a little step by step. So first thing we'll do is we go to the website, um, I'll put all the links in the description. But basically first you got to download the software, which is right here. I already downloaded it right here now. And then you also got to download the actual firmware itself. So in order to get to the firmware of your uh, device, you basically have to hold the mode while you turn it on. And that's it right there. So basically the firmware here is 1.05. And the latest firmware, let me show you here is uh, right here so let me just drop the actually you can see right there so the latest right here is uh, 1.9 1.09 so I got them both downloaded and then so let me just put this camera back here we go we're just going to use this uh, micro USB and one goes into the computer and one goes into here So there you go. Alright, so let's get over here to the computer. So we'll go ahead and download the, or uh, I guess install the updater. So open this up, close that. Go here and go ahead and set it up. So yes, we want to do that. English. Put in that folder. Yep. Don't need a uh, shortcut. So you gotta sell the drivers as well. Well, I guess yeah. We'll go ahead and launch it now. So here's the updater now. We're going to browse for our firmware and it already shows that that's what we have because we're plugged in now, which is basically the same as right here. So we'll go ahead and uh, go here where the firmware is. We're going to just double click on that and we'll, we'll just go ahead and drag it out onto the desktop. That way it's easier to find close that and then we'll browse for it hit the desktop and then it's right there click open and click update it takes a few seconds and I'll just keep this series so you can watch what it's doing it auto disconnected by itself and it already powered back up with the latest firmware and then you can check this out simply by turning this off and then hold on let me put the camera here again So we just unplug it now. But if you basically hold the mode and turn it on this time, now it's 1.9 or 1.09. So that's done. That's nice and up to date. And that's how you update the firmware. Thanks for watching.